Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says the perimeters of two similar triangles are 20 cm and 10 cm respectively. If one side of the first triangle is 5 cm, find the corresponding side of the second triangle. So in this question we are given two triangles which are similar to each other. We are given their perimeters also and we are given one side of the first triangle. We have to find the corresponding side of the second triangle. Let's first recall the result which says that the ratio of the perimeters of two similar triangles is the same as the ratio of their corresponding sides. This is the key idea for this question. Now let's move on to the solution. Consider these two triangles PQR and ABC. We are given the triangle PQR is similar to the triangle ABC. Then we are given perimeter of say triangle PQR V equal to 20 centimeters and Perimeter of triangle ABC B equal to 10 centimeters. And we are also given that one side of the first triangle is 5 centimeters. So we suppose that QR B equal to 5 centimeters. We are supposed to find the length of the corresponding side of the second triangle. That is we need to find the length of BC. We take let BC be equal to x centimeters. Now, as we know that the ratio of the perimeters of two similar triangles is same as the ratio of the corresponding sides. Therefore, we say that perimeter of triangle PQR upon Perimeter of triangle ABC is equal to the ratio of the corresponding sides. So this would be equal to QR upon BC. Now we have perimeter of triangle PQR as 20 centimeters. So 20 upon the perimeter of triangle ABC which is 10 is equal to QR that is 5 upon BC which we have assumed to be X and from here we have X is equal to 5 into 10 upon 20 this 0 cancels with this 0 and so we get X equal to 5 upon 2 or you can say this is equal to 2.5 centimeters so we had assumed BC to be equal to X centimeters. Therefore we get BC is equal to 2.5 centimeters. Hence we say the corresponding side of the second triangle is 2.5 centimeters. So this is our final answer. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.